Hi everyone, this is Gabriel from Blue My Mind reporting for August 28th. I'd like to give you a little tutorial about Skype running on a Macintosh. This is currently how the program loads when you have it installed on a Mac. So basically how it works is you type in your username. Like so. As it's signing in, there is this minor pause that kicks in. And then all of a sudden you have your, your contact list appear. Uh, in my scenario, I haven't updated my Skype in, in a long time, so I'll just skip this. And here is the, the program display. You can go through all your contacts as you please. And uh, if you double click on the person, you'll be able to call them. Otherwise, you can click on call phones. And here is the way you would call any number and just by dialing in the number and call. And away it goes. As you can see, you I have a total in Canadian dollars because I prepaid for it, but. Um, Skype offers a method to pay three to four dollars a month which allows you unlimited long distance to Canada and the US here are a few promotions that Skype has at this current time for three dollars a month you're able to call anyone in Canada or the US if you want for six dollars you can call landlines from Mexico or many countries which include Australia Belgium China which also includes cell phones Denmark Finland Germany Guam Hungary Israel Japan Luxembourg Mexico New Zealand Poland Puerto Rico Spain Switzerland United Kingdom Australia Canada Chile Czech Republic Estonia, France, Greek, Greece, Hong Kong, Ireland, Italy, Korea, Malaysia, Mexico, Netherlands, Norway, Portugal, Singapore, Sweden, Taiwan, and USA. So it's really worth using if you plan on doing voice over IP long distance since it's very inexpensive and you can pay by PayPal. So if you're scared of paying, you don't need to anymore. So um going back to the program you're able to chat with people you just click on their name as such and click on this button and you're able to chat as you're adding more people to your list your list gets bigger and oops, you can call anyone you want just by clicking on that if they have a video camera on their name it means you can chat with them and I actually have a video conference going so that's it try Skype when you can let me know what you think thanks